after the passage of two opposition bills today in Parliament, um, at the close of Parliament, um, I tabled a motion of no confidence in the government. Uh, what a motion of no confidence in the government uh, means is that uh, under our Constitution, the government must continue to operate with the confidence of the House. And if the government loses confidence in the House, then it's time for the people to go back to the polls uh, for an election. So in our view, uh, it was right and proper after the government, after the opposition was able to pass two bills for the House over the government's objections, that we would table a motion of no confidence and would test the confidence of this House. Um, it's important that Bermuda has a strong and stable government. It's important that uh, the country has uh, a government that represents the views and feelings of the people inside this country. And we felt that it was necessary for us to table this motion. It is a responsibility of the opposition at all times to test the confidence of the House. And that is what we did today. Mr. Bart, if the vote of no confidence were to pass, what happens? What's the effect? Um, if the vote of no confidence were to pass, then that would mean that the uh, Premier uh, would be uh, need to go to Government House and would call an election.